When the baby girl was born in a rural hospital in July 2010, her mother had just tested positive for HIV. And because mother-to-child prevention treatment had not been received, doctors knew the baby was at high risk of infection. They put her on a cocktail of three HIV-fighting drugs instead of the normal one. So follow-up labs at 23 months showed a standard viral load test, showed an undetectable <coughs> viral load at less than 20 copies per ml. And um, a repeat was drawn with the idea that perhaps this was a lab error. A repeat test done with, uh, two weeks later again showed less than 20 copies per ml. Researchers believe use of the more aggressive antiretroviral treatment when the child was just days old likely resulted in her cure. So we believe that perhaps the initiation of very early antiretroviral <coughs> therapy prevented the formation of the viral reservoirs in central memory CD4 T cells that are the barriers to cure and really sets the stage for a pediatric cure agenda going forward. Doctors caution that more testing will need to be done, however. They want to see if the treatment will have the same effect on other children. But the results so far could change the way babies at high risk of infection are treated and could possibly lead to a cure for children with HIV.